The Azaleos VOX CIO dashboard allows busy IT executives to stay abreast of any real-time changes in status on key indicators for a wide variety of servers, hardware, and systems running in the private cloud. Unlike monolithic management frameworks and portals used by systems administrators, the VUX dashboard provides a concise, graphical, and real-time view of need-to-know metrics and status of applications. To achieve this same level of visibility, organizations would need to stitch together silos of data from multiple applications using expensive and complex systems management software. Okay, jumping into this demo now. After logging in with a secure password, the IT exec lands in the main dashboard screen presenting a top-level view of the core systems managed by Azaleos. Exchange, SharePoint, Link, Active Directory, BlackBerry Enterprise Server, and various storage systems. A single pane for each service presents a primary key status indicator for the system, such as RPC average latency for Exchange. But an easy click here, for example, on the Exchange pane allows for drill down into additional details. Here, the IT exec is presented with additional data specific to the Exchange server, analytics such as total items, Outlook web app peak users, active sync current requests, and additional graphs on users and message flow history. There are even options to drill into the Exchange mail stores and then export that data out to Excel or a CSV file. If still greater details needed on any of the graphs or charts, an additional click, for example, on Exchange user history can provide further information. Here, the IT exec can see a week's view of Outlook users by location with additional drill down options in these tabs for connections or by server views. Back on the main screen, similar details are also available for SharePoint. Here, a click drill down presents the user with detailed information and graphs on indexing, queries, sites, and database sizes. Like the Exchange view, any one of these graphs can be queried at a deeper level with a single click. Moving next to the Link Unified Communications Server, a drill down presents helpful information on such details as certificate expiration, inbound and outbound phone calls, and which of the different server roles are installed and operational. The graph below covers a day view of phone calls, conferences, and IM sessions for the company, and can also be drilled into further to focus in on just a single element, such as phone calls. For Active Directory, a click drill down presents the exec with either a forest domain domain controller hierarchy as seen here, or a quick click over to the sites tab a, with a simple site map, which shows the geographical distribution of the active directory hierarchy and confirms with the green lines that the domain controllers are correctly replicating. Now drilling down on the BEZ server, we can see important information on the BEZ server version, messages sent, and received and messages queued for delivery. Especially important, we can see how many devices have been offline here in this pie chart for an extended period of time, during which time their service plans might be costing the company thousands of dollars if still activated. And also see a detailed list of the specific users and their uptime status for troubleshooting. Drilling further, a quick click into the message flow graph provides the exec with details about messages sent and received. And in this case, messages received by location, where we can see the Connecticut location devices are receiving the lion's share of the deliveries. Storage is an integral part of any messaging or collaboration system. In the initial drill down here, the IT exec is presented with top level information on either their NetApp or EMC storage hardware. A quick click into the EMC details will show an overview of transactions per second load and storage volumes, as well as a representative visualization of the system shelf showing the individual disks green for good, orange for predictive failure, and red for complete failure. On the servers tab, the different hardware, their physical location, and their relative CPU and RAM load, as well as the server roles that occupy them are shown. Purple servers are standard, and bluish-gray servers are virtual hosts. Finally, the Virtual Server Hosts tab will highlight information relating to both the hosts and the guests running on that host hardware. At times, real-time information just isn't enough for the IT exec. Historical information for analysis or reporting is just as critical. The VUX Dashboard report section provides a selection of different monthly reports across Exchange, Active Directory, Link, etc., which can be accessed in PDF format. Finally, the VUX dashboard also allows the busy IT exec to keep track of all her systems in multiple geographical locations. 
as Elios not only plots the GPS coordinates on the monitor data centers around the globe, but also tracks the specific system server roles which are being monitored and managed at any given location, such as here in the Seattle office. Finally, here back on the main screen, in addition to all the important information shown so far by the Azaleos dashboard, Azaleos also keeps a running tab of all the key service alerts being worked on by the Azaleos operations team, and also provides an easy way for the IT exec to drill into additional systems and servers monitored by Azaleos. Given today's complex and tightly integrated IT systems, it can often be quite difficult to recognize conditions that can impact your business. You've seen here how the Vuex CIO dashboard aggregates and distills thousands of data points gathered by the Azaleo's patented Vuex monitoring technology and used by our network operations staff into a single graphical view and provides a clear up to the minute view into the state of the Microsoft Unified Communications ecosystem. IT execs no longer have to find themselves on the reaction end of problems reported by end users. Customers have entrusted the heavy lifting of managing their IT environments to Azaleos, so we created the Vuex dashboard to meet the requirements of IT execs who are focused on managing the business of IT, not the technology itself.